There are a couple of fundamental ways to understand if our model is learning while we are training our model. One, look at the accuracy. Is it increasing? Two, look at the loss. Is it decreasing? Or three, look at the training validation curves in the loss and accuracy. Are they following each other or are we over or underfitting? However, this doesn't give us that much insight in the model itself. Fortunately, there's a great way of doing real-time or runtime debugging. In other words, debugging our model while it's training by tracking the gradient. The gradient is what the model uses to know how much to change or update the weights in each iteration. More specifically, it's what the backpropagation uses to update the weights. And quick note, if you're not familiar with the term backpropagation, it's the fundamental method behind the training of neural networks invented by researchers, uh, including Jeffrey Hinton, uh, back in the 1980s. Anyway, if we analyze the gradient in different trainable layers or operations, we can easily see if our model is learning or not. For example, if the gradient is flat or vanishing, our model is not learning. In Perceptor Labs, we have made it super easy to track and follow the gradient during training. Let's take a quick look and do some runtime debugging. I created a simple convolutional neural network and I used the dataset MNIST. Let's start training the model. If we take a look at the gradient here during training, we can see if the gradient is vanishing or exploding or if it just looks healthy. In this case, it looks healthy. We can see that we have a gradient and it's not exploding and it's not vanishing. But if the gradient would have been flat here, for example, it means that the model is not learning. So we need to go back to the model and change some settings and hyperparameters to make it work. And this is a great way to use the gradient to debug your model during runtime. There, ML developers, tracking the gradients is very powerful when debugging your models. And it's as simple as what I just showed you.